Patrick Dempsey looked every bit the Prince Charming at the premiere for Enchanted, and his wife looks thrilled to be on his arm. It's fun to get dressed up and to do a ballroom scene very much like uh, Beauty and the Beast, and uh, I, it was special for that. Dempsey's career hit a rough patch in the 1990s, and without a stylist, he didn't look so hot. Here he is in 1997, but by early 2000, he pulled himself together, snagged several hit movies and TV shows, and McDreamy was born. Here's Justin Timberlake at the Love Guru premiere. He's really come into his own with the sort of hip, preppy look that has been emulated on red carpets and runways everywhere. However, Justin has wrestled with a little problem since he first exploded on the scene with NSYNC in the late 90s. The Afro. You can't miss it. Justin rocked his big blonde afro for years. Finally, after going solo and breaking from his boy bandmates, some smart stylist snatched him up and set him right. But even though he looked like a clown, that never stopped him from being a hit with the ladies. No, I'm not dating Drew. I just met her this evening. Anything else? Toby Maguire is adorable. Here he is at the Oscars with his wife. However, he's also a little follicularly challenged. Thank you. Year after year, Toby showed up on the red carpet unshaven and proud. And the times he did bother to shave, his clothes were inappropriate. However, his Spider-Man fame cleaned him up and made him the superhero he is today. It's not a, not a superhero thing. Okay, take a look and see if you can guess who this is. Want a hint? Okay, listen to his voice. Who's in this film? Uh, I'm fantastic. I mean, what are you going to do? I mean, it's the best, you know, couldn't be better. You'll never believe it, but that's our current 007, Daniel Craig. Talk about a top secret makeover, or maybe his beard was just a big disguise. You be the judge. in cement and just what happened the day they did. On October 16, 1997, Al Pacino was joined by his The Devil's Advocate co-star Keanu Reeves and TV talk show host Larry King as he placed his prints in cement.